a male, come on. We all want to be the man and we want to fucking lay down and we want to be able to, to we want to be able to say that we can actually get down and we can get down and we can, you know, hold her on and we can get past that part, you know, that makes it too short for the woman to actually have her fun. So from I'm this having con- fun. This I'm conversation fun. is, I guarantee you, it's going to be about the ongoing argument that we have. I hate it when it's right. About duration right. of sex. Because, again, okay. I only can compare he, what I do. Yes. And she says, obviously, she's, you know, other partners. Girls we're, talk. We're, we're, right. you know, we, we're, we were both not virgins when we got together. So there's, <laughs> there's a little bit of experience on both sides away from each other. The difference is me being the male, I have a little bit more control. Or I shouldn't say control. Thank goodness I have control. When sometimes a male doesn't have control and the duration is this. That's is the there topic. a little what bit of nervous the, chatter What going is on the over duration? There. What? What is the duration, an average duration of sex? What is it? No, that's not that's the only the question. Thing. And no, there's not nervous energy. It's just me trying to bring this up without trying to sound like I'm fucking sucking my own cock too much. <laughs> He's good at that. Okay, not only duration, but frequency. Like how many times a week do you have sex? How long does it last? I need to know. Because he's, okay, you've watched the videos. You see him. He, when he does something, he does it, and he does it thoroughly. Thank you. And that blankets pretty much anything that he does in life. <laughs> I'm like, it, it, when see, is enough I is would enough? say thorough is probably not the word that describes me best. OCD. Yes, but extreme. Because in my mind... If you're gonna do something, it's just fucking all the way. If if it's you think about doing something a little bit, I'm not getting out of the chair. I don't need to be beat to holy hell to get where I need to go. <laughs> well, to say there, it. there's there's the there is the whole concept behind. <clears throat> excuse me. A female will make a request. She likes it. Blank. Maybe it's. I can't remember the last time I asked for anything. Well, they're not talking about what you, because you know, we've been well, together for. I kind of know what you want, so you don't have to ask me. I just give it to you. And, and another one. Whether I want that's it good, or not. That's, right. that's another one too. Is hey, listen, this can happen willingly or unwillingly. So one way or the next, drop your pants. It's up to you. Oh yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> the that's choice good. is yours. His pickup lines. His hey babies are the best. Woman. Drop your pants. Unclothe. Quickly. Oh, oh. go warm it up. <laughs> but anyway, the question comes down to, what is the duration? Average. We're just, we're just looking for average, not your overall best time. I'm, I'm not... I just want an average. I want someone to knock it down a notch for me. Give a sister a break. Well, but I mean, it... it don't think that whatever the answer is is going to change what I do. This is just going to help us. Solve, this is going to help solve this this question or this ongoing, you know, back and forth we have about. He thinks we're what average. Is a good. Well, I don't say average, but I think she thinks that people don't have a sex life like we do, and I'm saying that can't be right. That can't be right. I know there are other people like me, no. and. You know, the question would be Not more. A virgin. Would be would be more of the question. If there are more people like her that can endure the roller coaster ride. <laughs> That's but, how I gauge how well I'm doing. But either way, it really comes down to, you know, what is it? It's, it's there's such a, a wide array of people and personalities. What is the average sex life? You know, how often does it happen? How long does it happen? These are the questions that we go back and forth with. And maybe there's a piece of me that is holding up my end of the argument because it allows me to continue what I do on my end of the argument. (laughs) He's just making sure nobody puts the kibosh on his party. Well, let's be real. Let's be honest. Nobody's going to put the kibosh because no matter what the answers are or are not, it's still going to be the same thing over here, which is going to say... I'm crying. Well, it, it's time. Go unclothed. Let's get down. It's not... It's not, You know what? It's not even that's that actually, nice. That's that was kind of soft. That's a lot. That's a lot. <laughs> Woman! Go drop your pants! Woman! Go warm it up! 
Actually, my favorite one is Let's Hump. Oh, yeah. That's my favorite one. <laughs> my, our kids I mean, think that that word is word so gross. Hump um, is the word hump the best fucking word on the planet? I'm going to hump you. No, not even hump. Just say hump. Hump. God, I love that word. Let's hump. That's fucking good. And you know, when you say hump, what I envision is a big, like, hump under the covers. You know, when you walk in and you see your parents humping, you just see the fucking hump under the covers, you know? Oh, poor kids. And then, and then as a young boy, you just, you just, you sit there and you get this sick feeling in your stomach and you say, stop hurting my mom. <laughs> And then your dad says, get the fuck out of here, or whatever he's going to say. But the bottom line is, you walk in there and you see a hump okay. under the fucking covers. Just so you know. And then wait. the word hump is born. <laughs> that, that whole scenario that he was speaking of was not our children. That was him. Him yes. walking in on his mother. <laughs> yeah, I honestly say... We locked the door. <laughs> yeah, I would honestly say our kids... They know they've walked in, but I don't think they actually take a stand with saying something. I think they walk in <laughs> and they, the they sneak back out of there so that they pretend oh, it no. didn't happen or something. I've had our middle daughter, Taylor May, um, she, she'll always like, oh, God, and she'll slam the door. Go, Hurry up. I got a question. Like, finish. I'm like, how can we finish when we know you're standing on the no, outside the of the best, door? The best one was the oldest daughter who's actually having... Our grandson. I haven't told but you that. We're going to be grandparents. Anyway, yeah, they already know. Oh. But anyway, the lights, excuse me, the power turns off. Oh, no. Probably <laughs> shortly after I said, let's hump. <laughs> and so we had just gotten into motion. Well, fuck, man. It gets really fucking quiet when the power goes well, out. Yeah, and so. Next thing you know, <laughs> it stayed out for a long fucking time. And we wake up the next morning, and she was absolutely sickened with us. Pissed. She was sickened pissed. with us. The power went out, and I was like, yeah. She goes, I could hear everything. <laughs> so, Sorry. long and short, you know, what's it come down to? Now, granted, every male on the planet has had the one-two pump and dump. We've all done it. Embarrassing, yes. If you can't admit that it's embarrassing when you fucking drop a nut too quickly, have a fucking look at yourself in the mirror and be honest. When you actually have a bit of control and you feel like you're the fucking man, which, of course, every male wants to feel like that, obviously, then we get into, when you're young, how long can you go? And then you start to wonder, okay, what's sex life with everybody else? And you start talking about experiences, this, that, and other. We actually have a relationship where we can talk about sex obviously with ourselves, but experiences with others, which yeah. really is what kind of encompasses this conversation. So, <laughs> my peeps, what do you think? What do you actually feel the average sex session in terms of duration and frequency? Frequency, meaning, let's say per week would probably be the yeah. best way to gauge it, yeah. you know? Because it's not the time, that, like in college, you know, Jesus Christ. I mean, and this is... You know, this is straight up. 18 years old, you can't possibly get enough nuts. I mean, I was a jerking off machine when I was in college. You couldn't possibly dump enough semen. It was just, it felt like it was coming Ew, out your ear. Uh, dump you enough know? semen. I mean, Jesus That's the Christ. first time I've heard that. Ew. I'm telling you, just just kind of like the snot rock, rockets. Well, you, 